Hello friends and welcome to a brand new video of infotainment. Well in this video we'll see how to properly convert your excel file into pdf. It sounds so simple but I'll explain it in detail. So let us go to the computer. So as you can see uh, this is the excel file that I was talking about. You can have your own excel file as well. So here there are like two ways to uh, do that. Uh, either you can like uh, save it as a pdf. You can go and uh, save as browse and uh, you can see here save as type we can select there's something called pdf so once you select pdf you'll be coming into the same space where you can see the option which i'll be explaining you in a short while uh, you can also go to a place called file export once you do that you'll find this option here you'll choose this create pdf slash xps so once you click here it'll take you to almost same page uh, we will be finding this kind of the same option will be finding so just put your name here look uh, when you choose this that export uh, file will be redirected to be saved in the same folder as you can see as the original excel file is so what you can do is just change your name and uh, for example for this video i'll just write test one and you can see it has already chosen dot pdf that is pdf format so here you can see there is something called uh, standard for publishing online and printing and there is something called minimum size publishing online. So you can choose between two. If you are not publishing it online and for your own purpose you can choose standard or else if you want a smaller size you can go for minimum size. So here and the option as you can see open file after publishing. So once you uh, like publish this file it will automatically open for you to see that file exit file. So here another thing there is called options. So if you click on options, it will take you to this page where you can see a lot of options coming like uh, page range all or you can choose the pages as well. If you want to like uh, choose uh, specific pages from it's a small file, but if you have a long file like uh, 10 to 15 pages, you can also choose pages as you choose while printing your Excel file. I'll just select the option of all. And uh, most probably it will come the same because it's a very small uh, data I have in this Excel file. Here in the second thing you can see publish what? Either the selection your entire or your entire workbook or the active sheet. You can publish the selection and the same thing that comes while printing that is selection your entire workbook or your active sheet. Uh, by default the active sheet has been selected and there's something called include non-printing information uh, like document properties. If you select this all the properties of the document will stay and uh, document structure tags for accessibility. These two things you can as it is already been selected by default just keep it as it is and if possible you can uh, like uh, select this for archiving and all ISO 19005 compliant so it's not required right now so I'll just uh, click OK here once I click OK I start publishing I'll press publish here so once I publish you can see uh, automatically that file will be launched as I have selected that so let's see how it is coming yeah you can see a beautiful file has come here including tables my uh, pie chart everything I, uh, this is a readable PDF file. It has retained the properties as I've shown you in that uh, in those options. Uh, you can like select and maybe copy or paste it to another Excel file if you want. So I'll just select this. It may not uh, like paste in the same manner as you are seeing here, but it will at least recognize or uh, read the text. You can see name, number of apples, letter, all these things. It has already read that letter so friends i hope you knew how to uh, export excel into pdf in the proper way that i've shown you by going through different options so use these things and uh, get beautiful pdf out of your excel file so friend that's it i hope this video was useful for you if you found this video useful please like this video and please don't forget to share this video across various platforms so that many people come to know of this uh, technique of exporting excel into pdf and please don't forget to subscribe to this channel infotainment to get more of such little little technical videos to make your digital life simpler and easier so till our next video see you again see you soon keep watching infotainment thank you